brought to you at 5.30 a.m. Um, we're on our way to the airport right now. Oh, yeah. Big in. That was a big in. Oh, um, so it's raining and storming, and Jared goes, we're about to have a manifest IRL, so. Hope Sorry, are we flight 828? You better not be. You guys are standing in the rain. It's, it's raining. Yes, I was, oh. I was just. And we're standing. Should we dance? <laughs> I was just <laughs> saying that. Um, yeah, so get excited. Okay, it's lunch time. Um, I got lunch, lunch time. I got lunch at a very, very oh, cute. Oh, yeah. Can you hush. Oh, wait, I should actually. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Okay, anyway, I got lunch at this very cute place. Um, and they were playing wonderful music, and I want to move in and live there. Um, so I got a kid's kombucha, and oh, here's the sandwich. Hold up. It's turkey, provolone, arugula, bacon. Eating good. Did they toast that? It's warm. Okay, this is Dad's meal. I, um... Jared and I went to um, Mo's Italian Mo's. sandwiches, and I got a pastrami. Mm -hmm. It's, it I think is gonna taste a lot better than it looks. And uh, Jared finished his gigantic pickle, and he's getting into his. You finished it already? Salami sandwich. Yeah, he's got bread and salami. Well done. That's literally it. Mhm. Mm um, where are the seagulls? What's up, boys? How's it going? Um, so I, like, forgot to... Oh, Dad's going this way. Um. Absolutely dropping, dude. Let's go. Okay, so I, like, forgot to vlog pretty much the entire time we were in New Hampshire, but... You wonder why? Because you suck! <laughs> I don't... <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, we just kind of, like, walked around... I bought a book from this like bookstore and the lady who I met there actually just got like her um, citizenship in Spain and she's like going to teach there and um, yeah she was really cool so I bought a book and we just went into some other cool shops and then drove here we're in Portland Maine now and we're just gonna walk around and then get dinner it's very pretty here Okay, we are at our first seafood restaurant. It's very apparent we're from the Midwest. Um, just cause I don't know what any seafood is. That's okay. I have a blueberry lemonade. Very cute. And I got mussels. Um, I'll show them to you. They're very delicious and they come with fun bread. So that's exciting. We also have toys. These things are for when we eat our lobster, um, which will be so exciting. Just informed on how to eat these. Also Use a fork to like, get it out of that. And then here's, I don't know if you can, can you see that in there? And then I apparently use this like a pincher. Oh my gosh. You're a pro. So now I look like a local, so. This is so fun. Okay. Oh, you're not gonna eat it? I have no. my lobster. You not want this? Okay. Wait, did you just break it? Yeah. So, you know, you uh, flatten it. No, no, no. And then you're gonna twist it. <laughs> Thanks or for getting that all over us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not cut out for this. What is this green stuff? Seaweed. Really? Kale. This is inside the body. It's lobster food. <laughs> It's all over your face. Is it really? No. Oh. This is stressful. Maybe I should wear my bib. Right. Do the locals wear bibs? I don't know. Okay. This just in. The whole lobster is edible. So I've torn it apart. And apparently that green stuff is the insides. And honestly, it would make a good chip dip. <laughs> after I've eaten it and tasted it. Lobster tested. guac. Yeah. Um, I had this delicious salad. But it's all gone now. It was like a blueberry vinaigrette thing 
Um, I've taken the hip muscles. I hit pretty hard. There's still some left. And I'm gonna finish this lobster and call her a night. Uh, we've made it to Bar Harbor. And um, you just put an ice cube down my shirt. Why would you do that? No, the hair is like. Why? Okay. Anyway, so we drove like three hours and now we're here and we're about to go on like this like nature boat ride. Where did this ice piece go? Right here. Anyway, um, it's very. Stop it. It's very lively here. What else do you have to say? I have to pee. That's literally all you have to say. And I also hope we do the e-bikes. That's pretty sick. That's about it. Okay. Dad got first in line to go on our boat tour. So. That's right. Represent. Say it. Yeah. I had some clam chowder for lunch. And I had a hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Really so reaching it. Apparently the air temperature when we like go on the boat, well at 6 a.m. it was 56 degrees. So maybe it'll be a little warmer today, um, but we are dressed ready for cold this. But the, this is a beautiful day and I overheard the people behind us say that this has been the nicest day in months. So, or maybe it was weeks. I don't really remember. Yay. Okay, we got on the ship. Um, Private tour. Dead. So there's the oh the view the views the boat's already rocking. Hopefully you don't get seasick. Oh it works. So yeah. It's supposed to be ten to fifteen degrees cooler out there than it is right now, which is good because um I'm wearing long pants. So all right, doesn't look like many Pretty people are home so today. Probably a lot of guys are out hunting today. Today is a really nice day. Yeah. Not surprised. We're not seeing yeah. a lot of just sitting so, around. That'll do it. It's been windy, but the weather is good. There's a lot of people here now. Yeah. But it's been, it's been a good time. We haven't gotten seasick. And the views are good. We saw some. By the way, guys, fun little facts. So Sheep Porcupine actually got its name because they used to actually actively keep sheep out here. Yeah, back in the day, the harbor would actually freeze, and they could walk sheep out here during the winter and load, load them up on this island. And uh, when that happened, yeah, the sheep would stay out here. Water's a natural, good natural fence. Uh, unfortunately, the uh, <laughs> the local guys would come by their boats and take pot shots at the sheep, so probably not the best thing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we just got done with dinner. We ate here, but I forgot to vlog. Um, it was very delicious. I had some sandwich with fish and other. Um, Still all my vegetables. I did. Um, Dad had some really good vegetables on his plate, so I ate them. And I did not. Yep. <laughs> and then we got some blueberry pie, and my teeth are kind of blue. Um, and yeah, it was very delicious. And now we are going to this walk on the sandbar in low tide. Yes. Um, we were warned that if the tide goes back up, though, we are camping on the island. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Okay, we made it. Walking on the ocean floor, as Dad just mentioned. But, oh, so pretty. Show everybody the big rocks. Oh, yeah. Dad was like, oh, look at the big rocks. And I had to correct him that they are actually boulders. So, Jared is back there. I love I, new knowledge. Yeah. Oh. Okay, Jared caught up with us. We just took some pictures. Um, Jared begged me to. I did not um, um, do that. He was like, Natalie, can we please stop and take pictures right now? Mm. The lighting on my skin is just perfect. So right. we, uh, Jared, I was like, Jared, right. I mean, if you insist, I guess we'll sure. take pictures. Right. So. Yeah, and the sky is purple. <laughs> and Canada is not on fire. So now we're looking for dad. We don't know where he went. So, so yeah. <clears throat> what was I going to say? Oh, we're we, going to confess. Oh, right. So we were what? watching the sunset, you know, on this beautiful little spot. It was like this big building and there's a pretty pool and the view was just really, really good. Curiously, no traffic. There's literally no one there. Um, so it turns out we've actually been trespassing for like an hour. On a very bougie property. Yeah. Um, 
But I am Waldo, the tour guide. I own this joint. I am J.P. Morgan's cousin. J. Uh, and it might have been, you know. J.P. Morgan's cousin. Gates. Yeah, that probably could have been. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we probably should have not walked Pat through these, but um. Whoops. Whoopsies. Yeah, it's okay though. Now we're walking to the car to go back to the hotel. Calling it a day. Good morning, it's like 6.30 a.m. And we just got, you can see that, to the Beehive Trail. It is about a two mile loop. Oh, it's so lush in here. We have begun. Yay. We have begun. <laughs> Warning, you may die. Well, that's nice. Anyway. <laughs> So last time we did one of these, Jared farted in my face, but the views, oh, I just kind of missed it, but uh, it is kind of foggy, but the views over there were really good, and we're having fun. Twice. What? Jared gets nervous and talks in an Australian accent, so that's what's happening right now. Now, like, can you shut your mouth? <laughs> this is a really good farm. Yeah, I think uh, that should be your senior picture. <laughs> Pose. <laughs> Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back to another YouTube video. <clears throat> Today, we made it to the top. It's made stop. It to the top. Stop. And it's really quiet, so I was whispering and then Jared decided to not whisper. It's really foggy though, so I can't really see much, but it's still a good view. Okay, we are starting our descent down. Um, Wait, who? Oh my gosh, you're on fire today, Jared. Um, that was actually a nice hike. I got, I got warm. It's like literally 60 degrees, but I'm like sweating right now. Um, and uh, yeah, I like don't hear. This is the views. So pretty. We lost dad again, bruh. Oh, there he is. No, I, I'll follow the blue line. <laughs> oh, so, it's a little foggy, but it's very pretty here. Yeah, if like a monster or something bad appeared out of this fog, I would actually not be surprised, but yeah. Okay, I think we're heading out of this now and trying to head back to the car. And yeah, it's only like eight o'clock right now, so we have the whole day um, to still do whatever we want but yeah very cool it started to rain on our hike if you can hear it um i don't really feel any drops yet the canopy of trees also look how folklore this is oh, it's so pretty it's like hobbit hometown yeah also dad found blueberries earlier look how blue they are and they're so tiny i think that's so fun it's 3.30 in the morning. We got up. Jared's really excited to be awake this morning. And we're going to the airport to go home. Yay! Hey. Wave. Wave. No. Wave. Nope. Do it. Wave. Nope. Oh, oh, that's a good one. 